At the beginning of 2020, Fexinidazo, the first all oral treatment for sleeping sickness, was rolled out in the Democratic Republic of Congo. We start in France, where the treatment was produced and released by Sanofi. Donated by Sanofi to the World Health Organization, Fexinidazole is then shipped to the Democratic Republic of Congo by Medzons on Frontier Logistics. DNDI and the National Sleeping Sickness Control Program have trained medical staff on how to use the new treatment. Fexinidazole is now ready to be given to patients. It is shipped to the remote areas of the DRC, where people are most at risk of being bitten by the sesafly, which transmits the disease. The treatments arrive at Badundu Hospital, which was one of the sites where the clinical trials for fexinidazole were performed. Some boxes of fexinidazole are stored in Badundu Hospital, but the others have a longer journey. The next destination is Mushi, a town further down the Quilu River, one of the tributaries of the Congo River. The previous treatment for sleeping sickness was bulky and heavy to transport, but fexinidazole is light and easy to carry. At Mushi, the first patient to receive the treatment is a young boy, Guy Bogongo. Guy will receive treatment for 10 days with food. Previously, treatments required almost two weeks of hospitalization with IV infusions twice a day. Back in Badundu, Papa Jean was the first patient to receive this first oral treatment. The journey to get the treatment from the laboratory into the patient's hand has been a long one and is testament to strong partnerships between Sanofi, DNDI, the DRC Sleeping Sickness Control Program and many other partners. It is also a testament to the power of innovation in fighting neglected tropical diseases. But it is all above a testament to the will of Congolese sleeping sickness doctors to deliver appropriate treatments to their patients. Their call has been heard, and thanks to their work, Fexinidazole has arrived. Yeah.